February is Black History Month, and this week, State Champ salutes the Midnight Express, Eddie Tolan. Born in Denver, Colorado in 1909, at 15 years old, the Tolan family moved to Detroit. Tolan attended Cass Tech, where he was an outstanding football player and sprinter. On the track, Eddie set records in the 100 and 200 yard dashes. In 1927, he won both races at the National Interscholastic Championship at Soldier Field in Chicago. Recruited by many top-level schools for football, Tolan wanted to play at the University of Michigan. However, in 1927, no African-American had ever played football at Michigan. It's reported the coach wanted him to, other coaches did not. The record says officially it was because of injury. However, he ran track and definitely made the most of it. As a sophomore in May 1929, Tolan broke the Big Ten Conference record, tied the world's record for the 100-yard dash. Tolan was one of the first African Americans to have success in sprinting, and he raced with eyeglasses taped to his head. At the Big Ten Championships in May 1930, Tolan broke the world record in the 100. His performance was accepted as the new official world's record, and he became known as the Midnight Express. Tolan ran for America in the 1932 Olympics, and in one of the closest 100-meter racers in Olympic history, Tolan edged out a gold medal. He easily won the 200 meters and set an Olympic record. He was soon after dubbed the world's fastest human. In 1958, Tolan was inducted into the Michigan Sports Hall of Fame. He was also inducted into the University of Michigan Athletic Hall of Honor in 1980. Eddie passed away in 1967 but always said his first love was football. The six touchdowns he scored in one game as a 131-pound quarterback at Detroit's Cass Tech was his greatest thrill rather than his double win in the Olympics. State champs salutes the Midnight Express, Eddie Tolan.